Hey everyone, so we all know this that not everybody gets the chance to study in IITs or Ivy League universities but the good information or the news here is that we have access to several online learning platforms and in today's video I will share three online learning platforms that I rely on for my learning and they have contributed immensely in my learning process and for skill building. They've taught me several uh, courses and I enjoy learning from those uh, learning platforms because they talk in detail about those topics and they start from scratch so that if you don't have any knowledge about these you can just build up on that even though that has not been your uh, either topic of interest or that is something that you always feared learning so i will surely tell you about those but before that i want to make this process interesting and introduce uh, in, an interesting activity so that you can do it with yourself um, by writing it down or you could just do it with a couple of your friends so um, we live in a competitive world and I personally believe that I always ask myself that what is that one skill set that people associate me with and this is actually where I'm taking you to is that ask yourself uh, what is that one skill set that you are good at and which skill set you associate yourself with and then do the same uh, thing with your friends ask them which skill set they associate you with and then once you have that information that data try to see uh, if it matches or not and also uh, it will introduce you to certain things about yourself that you have not thought about because it's always very different how we see ourselves and how others see us and that shows us as to how uh, we can look at different dimensions of ourselves. In addition to that, I just want to tell you that if you are just completing your 10th grade or 12th grade, you have a lot of time for yourself left to grow and to build up yourself in different dimensions, uh, may it be physical, mental or spiritual. And that's it that I wanted to tell you before getting into uh, the the three online uh, open um open um, learning tools that I personally rely on uh, as I would have mentioned br uh, briefly about it that I've been learning from these platforms and they contribute so much in my learning process so um, let me just tell you more about them so the first one is MIT open courseware uh, this one has their specific website so all the three of them have their own specific websites and it's been approximately uh, 20 years since um, this one has been functioning and has been introduced and they have videos about science technology and they cover different aspects of science. So maybe life science, maybe computer science, maybe electrical engineering. And uh, I personally remember um, watching these videos when I was in my undergraduate studies, especially uh, for the subjects like mechanical engineering, for electrical engineering, electronic engineering, uh, because those were the subjects which I found a bit hard during my undergraduate studies. And um, the good thing about this MIT Open Courseware is that they talk in detail about a topic. So I still refer to these videos to understand more about Fourier uh, series, Fourier transform. And, um, and I also look into these courses, especially for some stat courses. These are really, really helpful. The next one that I want to talk about is NPTEL. So NPTEL is National Program for on Technology Enhanced Learning and this was established by the seven IITs from India and also along with Indian Institute of Science um, Bangalore in the year 2003. So this is also approximately um, like you know 18 to 19 year old um, initiative and they also have videos on so social science courses so have a look at this one. I will also provide the link uh, for their websites below my video. So have a look at that. Um, the third one is Coursera. I'm sure you might have heard about it. They have very, very interesting courses from different universities across the world. And uh, this was established in the year 2012. So this is uh, the, the recent one among the three that I mentioned. 
also on Coursera, you can find courses not just about science and technology. You can have courses about uh, social sciences, have courses on some special topics, have courses on business management, courses on well-being, on dog cognition, so many different ones. I, remembering, uh, I, I remember now that I attended one course on uh, neurobiology, um, covering different aspects of uh, neuroscience. And this was really interesting. Uh, if I remember correct, uh, it was a course from Duke University. But this I attended like some, I'm, I'm sure, like at least five years ago. So have a look at those uh, websites and keep learning, keep growing. The more you learn, the better you would feel. And uh, try to uh, see for yourself which skill set you want to build up on and then focus in that direction. So that's it for today's video. Let me know in the comment section below if you like this video and if you want um, more uh, videos which are focusing more on the resources. So the study uh, resources and the uh, online tools that I use, the online websites that, uh, that one could use for job searches, the, the online websites that one could use for internships and stuff. So let me know what you prefer and I see you very soon in other videos. So bye for now.